Montgomery Blair High School celebrated National Hispanic Heritage Month with a special bilingual panel called Si Se Puede. Bilingual panelists talked with over 100 students about their culture, heritage, professional, and life experiences. I want my students to see that they have role models in the community, role models in school. I want my students to also feel empowered by the stories that our panelists are talking about to overcome adversity. The panelists highlighted the importance of being bilingual and bicultural, not only to preserve their culture, but also because of the many benefits in the job market and in life. I just told them that I think it's really important to speak two languages and that there's many benefits to not only maintaining the language that they already know, but to also become fluent in English. For police officers, we get paid more to speak two languages. So that's just one incentive. And of course, it's great that we can communicate to more people than we would be able to if we only spoke one language. It's really important for students to have a role model since, you know, when we come to this country, to the U.S., it's, it's very hard on some of us. So by uh, us doing this, it's uh, a way of showing them that it's possible, and not only it's possible, that they have some people they can count on. So uh, I want to be that person, and I guess all of the panel members that are here today can also be uh, some leaders and role models for students that have these dreams, and they can achieve them. The editors of La Esquina Latina, the Spanish section of the Montgomery Blair newspaper, Silver Chips, served as moderators of the panel. They asked about the panelists' background and how their Hispanic heritage influenced the panelists' careers and the choices that they've made in life. I think it's very important to um, include cultures, especially since Blair, our strength is the diversity. So Blair is a very diverse school, and it's just very important, especially since we have a high Latino population.